Well, it's a site that can give you the creeps. Mysterious webs covering trees. Stop laughing. Oh, it scares me. <laughs> Sometimes they appear overnight. Yeah, this is what some residents in Pearland have been dealing with recently, and they are trying to figure out what is weaving those webs. We sent David Gonzalez, our newly crowned bug expert, <laughs> to investigate, and he joins us now live from Pearland with more. David, what'd you find out? Hey guys, this is what we're talking about. I need you guys to check out this tree. This tree is covered in this silky web that was created by something called bark lice. And bark lice sounds gross, but check this out. This thing is actually very harmless and very common here in the Houston area. It's ugly. I think it is. And I work out in my yard a lot. I've just never seen anything like that. Thick silky webs cover one of Rebecca McElroy's trees. The web appeared almost overnight. I thought, thought it would spread to my grass. Wasn't sure. I didn't know anything about it. McElroy thought something bad had taken over her tree. Does it need to be treated and will it go away on its own? To answer that, I brought in certified arborist Brad Phillips with Arbor True to explain what exactly is happening. It's very common, especially in July, August months, your hottest months of the year. Phillips is talking about bark lice. Actually visualizing this particular species is quite difficult and I don't know if we'll be able to see one on here or not. The tiny, sometimes microscopic insects live on all trees and love live oaks like this one. Although unsightly, the bark lice and the web are harmless. They're only on the tree for the purpose of consuming kind of built up organic matter. So old pollen from springtime that hasn't washed off in the rain, for instance, which cleans the trees in the end. One of the worst things that you can do when you are concerned about an insect or a pest on a tree is to break out the chemicals and then begin to conduct chemical warfare on the tree. As the weather cools off, Phillips says the bark lice will move out until next summer. All right, and one thing that we learned as well is that this web can actually be hosed off if you really want to get rid of it. Also, one thing to know is that this web is harmless, but if you see it in the leaves, wrapped around the leaves, then you might actually be dealing with another kind of pest that might actually be harmful for your trees. But